<laughs> All right. Well, uh, this guy actually made a uh, retort uh, to my video. Um, oh my God, it's bad. Um, find the uh, the link in the description. You can watch it for yourself. Anyway, this is just a reproduction of his uh, actual experiment. But the difference is that I I used a solid ball um instead of a foam ball so that there's no talk of uh some kind some kind of strange illumination of uh uh light being passed through something that's translucent and still somehow casting a shadow it just it just doesn't work apparently he didn't like it so he can he he can look at his uh, a better definition of his own experiment and uh we'll see where we go with that Okay, so here we go. Here's my flashlight. Okay, it is a single LED flashlight. Laid out on the floor. Here's my baseball. Okay, and just like yours, it's casting the shadow from the very bottom of the baseball. Okay. Umbra. Penumbra. Direct light. Umbra. Penumbra. Direct light. Now the reason why I have this paper on the floor here is because the linoleum on the floor produces a glare. Okay, I'll show you that in a second. And the reason why I didn't want the glare is because I put way over here a piece of paper up on the side of a laptop. Umbra, penumbra, direct light, umbra, penumbra, direct light, okay, are we clear on this? Now, I'm going to take the paper off the bottom just to show you why I put the paper on there. I used a hard surface ball. So there was no discussion of how foam somehow allows light to pass through it translucently when actually translucent light doesn't allow light to actually cast direct lines. Okay? It will glow locally, yes it will. But it will not allow a long transmission of light. Okay? So, I'm going to take these pieces of paper out. I'm going to show you why I put those pieces of paper there. Okay, there's a, a wonderful glow that happens when on the PVC on the floor, same light, same ball, but you'll notice over here these glows here, and that's because of the light, the light that's coming underneath here. You can see me actually manipulating it. Okay, it has to do with light on the floor below it so I put those pieces of paper on there so that this reflected light wouldn't happen okay so but up here it's unaffected pretty much umbra penumbra direct light let's show you what exactly umbra penumbra and direct light are supposed to be Okay, look familiar? So, direct light. Penumbra, where a portion of the light is cut off, but only another portion is seen. And then, umbra, which is completely without line of sight on the actual light. Direct light. Penumbra. Umbra. It has nothing to do with earth, flat earth, the sun, anything like that. It has to do with how shadows are cast. I mean, come on. I don't understand why you got to make a big deal out of it. You're just being a dumbass. You have a wonderful day. Hehehehe <laughs>